Getting back to our top story, those who live in Schuylkill County are really hoping that the rain stops soon. Tremont is under a state of emergency this evening, and people who live there and in Pine Grove are trying to clean up what Mother Nature has left behind and prepare for what's on the way. Eyewitness News reporter Cody Butler has more from Tremont. Kenneth and Nick, good evening. The Relief Center has moved from Pine Grove High School to Tremont's Ambulance Association as officials are deeming this part of Schuylkill County the hardest hit area, and residents are preparing for more rain to come. You can still hear the raging water in Tremont and see where devastation has hit. I've never seen it this bad in 44 years of living. It, I went through the flood of 72. Bill Berry is worried the amount of rain that's on the way could raise the creek outside his home once again to an unsafe level. Two to five inches, and I don't know if we can handle it. Tremont officials are trying to locate a place for American Legion Post 384 to store their belongings as high water condemned the building as part of their foundation washed away. Seven miles down the road in Pine Grove, American Legion 374 has been dealing with several inches of water in their basement. Unfortunately, the American Legion is a lot of older veterans, so us younger people have to step up, and it's really hard. The North End Fire Company pumped nearly two feet of water out Monday. We didn't close. We stayed open, so we're keeping it running. This rain-covered road is caused from the pond at Veterans Memorial Park overflowing its banks. It's also a place geese are congregating. All of our local emergency services are here for our community. Back in Tremont, Mayor Rick Nye held his second press conference on the devastation in his borough. Clear out those basements, get our dumpsters in, get your stuff out, and help you move forward. The Salvation Army and the American Red Cross are providing cleaning kits for anybody in the affected areas. In Tremont, Cody Butler, Eyewitness News. Mayor Ricky Day says there is a 9 p.m. curfew for everyone in Tremont, and for now, the state of emergency in Tremont does not have an expiration date.